What is up everyone, it's Officer Glock here with a small lag spike, and as I promised, I am bringing you guys a DLT video. I'm just expanding a little bit, just to, um, I don't know, bring some diversity to the channel, so not all, not what all you see is just, um, it's just tier C videos, so... I mean, I know, I know, police action is is fun, but eventually it gets it gets boring. Good, yeah. Unless it's like LCPDFR, I don't have that, but I would probably be playing that. Oh, I forgot. How silly of me! I forgot to introduce um um a guy. Sorry, you you were just so quiet. So. A guy will be playing as TRC letting me know of any cars that need to be towed. In the meantime, we're just going to be driving around. And um, in, this, in case this video does go up before um, the uh, episode 9 of TRC, I believe it is. Um, then I wanted to address the small issue that I've been having with um, War Thunder with the um, update launcher thing. It keeps updating forever, and then eventually gives me a crash dump thing, and it's been repeating that forever, and I can't play War Thunder anymore. And I would love to bring you guys War Thunder videos, because I'm okay. Body parts are flying. Um, Alex. Yeah. Uh. Actually, no. I'll ask you. Um, I'll ask you the question after the video. All right. Fair enough. Um. So yeah, I would love to bring you guys War Thunder videos because I know I know some of you like like World War Two and all that history stuff, but a bunch of other you guys just want the pure action and whatnot. You know, am I right, Omer? I guess yeah. Well, like I I I have Wonder War Thunder, but I don't have it at the same time. Basically, um, like I have the game, but I didn't really download the game. It was just there in my Steam library, just sitting there. It's sitting there collecting dust. The, the non-existent dust. Yeah, the only game I really play on Steam is Gary. Not that that's the only really official game that I really have, and I actually downloaded it. Probably in a loose connection to this. Ah, never mind. Okay. Well, yeah. So if I ever if I ever start a YouTube channel, it's probably going to consist of various games. Most likely, if I were to start a YouTube channel, it might not have this, but if I really wanted to record this, then I would put it on a different channel. Well, I mean, the reason why I'm recording stuff like this and not immediately jumping to GTA and whatnot is because the majority of the people that I really work with, I think they'll probably get curious enough and I'll probably post stuff on, like, the TRC wall. And then I feel that that's just a way to rack up support for my channel and then eventually I'll have a better foothold so if I do start a series that goes terrible, it won't hurt me as much, if you know what I mean. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Because I don't want to start a YouTube channel on... I, I was going to say ponies, but I don't want to... I don't want any bronies to send me hate mail. Because I don't really like it. I kind of dispo despise of it, but that's just me. So I really hope I'm not offending any one of you. I honestly... Up. I don't really care about it. I mean, like, I don't hate it, but I don't really like it at the same time. So you're neutral, essentially. Yeah. So, I mean, in, ca in case this does get boring, I'm probably just gonna keep commentating throughout this. But, yeah, I don't, I don't, um, what was I s trying to compare it to? Again? Uh, LCPDFR. Oh, yeah. Like, I don't want to start a video on, um... Like LCP far and then no one watches that series, and then I have like a horrible YouTube channel starting out with, and then I'm gonna have a hard time like bringing up support. So I'd rather start with something that I know some people will like support me for, and some people will actually like give me a pat a good old pat on the back for. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. And, um, for those of you who are wondering about my delayed reactions, it's not delayed reactions, and it's just the server lag. 
Circle lag. I mean, Omer's almost got DC'd like three times because of it. Yeah. Oh my lord, I'm frozen. Okay, we're back. Or at least I think I was frozen. I probably let off the accelerator. And I'm thinking, I'm speaking about lag. If, if that's what's really happened, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna laugh. Oh, and also the driving is partially my fault because I'm, I'm using the controls of like other stuff like GTA and whatnot. But dr the horrible driving is partially my fault, but then it's also a part of lag. So, give or take what you th think of my driving. And also, I'm not the fastest typer. I really am. I'm not. I'm not that experienced with a keyboard. I mean, actually, in the previous TRC Patrol episode that I recorded, some guy called me an 11 year old because he says I type slow, like super slow. And I said something. Uh, I said uh, like, that. That's the complete opposite of me. Yeah, Omer's like you. You'll hear me type like. Like I'm serious. You you're like a freaking machine over there. Well, me is like a grandpa just sitting at a typewriter. It's like. T -t 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 -t. Oh. My bad. Oh, and also. The DOT vehicle is a, the DOT, the, the, yeah, the tow trucks and partially like some trucks, they're wide turning vehicles, so not all turns go the way you expect it. I'm just going to gear two. So what are you doing right now? Uh, I'm gonna have to do this traffic stop. Oh, never mind. I think I'm gonna have to go to. And <laughs> there's VIP again. VIP. Tr um. <laughs> I wonder what his reaction is gonna be this time. So, um, um, if I record any videos, I'm probably gonna start, I don't know, maybe with Battlefield Hardline, because that really looks like a good game to record. Yeah, I actually have the beta for Battlefield Hardline, but because of Xbox, I need l live for it. And there's VIP right there. Shout out to you, buddy. You've been a good pal. Well, you need to shout out me. Well, well, you're already in the video, so you're basically being shouted out throughout the entire video. And then there's a shout out to a guy who stole my account. Good kudos to you, buddy, for being in all my YouTube videos. Thanks. Or most of them, at least. So funky, I like funky music. Good thing you have headphones plugged in. If you un if, if you didn't have headphones plugged in, all of my videos would have to been taken. Okay. Hey, Omer, I got a reckless driver, EBN nine, and someone else in like a in a and gray Camaro. Something, something, right? Yep. They're they're driving down. T I would have gone to them, but I'm kind of like, um, like, hey, you want to hear the song? No, 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 do not play it, do not play it, do not, any music will, any music without the proper, without me putting anything in the description, which I don't know how, 
will result in um in the video being flagged for copyright and blocked in some countries or or just being taken down by YouTube completely. Uh my raid fall kind of glitched actually. <laughs> what is song? Oh, man. Is there seriously nothing to tow? Like I'm sitting here driving around, talk, trying to trying to conversate, so you guys aren't bored out of your minds. Which I'm pretty sure you probably am. I'm gonna click out of this video soon, but hey, I'm trying. So, so yeah. <laughs> hey Omar, did I ever tell you about the time where I jump hopped the fence of the Hudson River, and I used to, cause I used to live in New York City. And um, no. well, for, for, to the time I'm telling, well, I probably told them in like one of my earlier videos, but if you, ca in case you're new to them, um, to them, um, to my channel, I used to live in New York City, and um, over did I ever tell you about the time where I, where I used to hop the fence and jump into the Hudson River? No, you actually never told me. Well, me and my friends sometimes after school, like when we had nothing else, when well, nothing better to do, and this was like before I became like a YouTuber slash gamer. Well, yeah, of course. Oh, lag spike. You live in Florida. Sorry. Yeah, now I live in Florida. My mom just needs. And, um... So before that, like, I I didn't have any GameCube or anything. Now I... I well, that was, bef that was before I got the GameCube. Do you know how old the GameCube is? Uh... I it's don't like, know how old it is. It's, it's like from the old. 90s. I don't have a GameCube, but I have a GameCube controller. But because when I used to play the Wii, I, I did that. I played uh, with the um, GameCube controller with Super Smash Brothers. Oh yeah, and, I used to do that too. That was the yeah. best. And another thing, like the oldest console I had, or the oldest thing rather, I had I had a PS2 and a Game Boy Advance. And um, really, what I did when I get home, I used to just like I don't know. I used to kind of sit around the TV, watch the news, and yes, I do enjoy watching the news. So before you rush off to the comments saying, "Oh my God, you're lame," I did this because I had nothing else, nothing better to do. I had nothing better to do. Oh my God, you said that at the most perfect time. What? Because as soon as you said I had nothing else to do, I am on recall. I'm listening to um, Fedora's um, music, and as soon as you said um. Uh, I had nothing else to do. All I heard was, do something with your life. <laughs> that was perfectly timed. And VIP is behind me in a Mustang. We're just gonna pull into DLT. And, uh, back to the story. I would, um... Me and my friends would hop the fence, and we'd go swimming in the Hudson. And we especially Are did it... Are you even allowed to do that? Um, I mean, sometimes we get yelled at by, like, the dock workers but and whatnot. But we swam in, like, the shallow area. We didn't swim deep. Like, we just swam near the shore. And, um... It's actually this one time where I'm going in there alone because they had, like, homework to do. Either they had homework to do or they got grounded. And... So then I'm like, eh, time to do our pastime, and then I hop in, and it's like a little bit, it's like winterish, alright, it's like warming up, it's warming up, and I'm swimming in there, and I can't see the bottom of the lake, or the river, no one can, and then I'm swimming around, and I'm just sitting there, like, waving a bit, I don't know, just trying to, just doing my thing to stay afloat, when all of a sudden something tickles my foot, and I'm like, what the? F what was that? What was it? I don't know because I couldn't see into the water. It was so like, it was kind of murky a little bit, but it wasn't anything that would harm me. Anyway, something s swam by my foot, and I'm like, eh, what is that? But then I thought at the time I thought it was just like one of those times because there are times where. You're swimming in the water, and then all of a sudden there'll be like a current of water that runs straight through your foot or something. And then it gives you that kind of feeling. So then I'm, I, I pass it off like, hey, it's just one of those current things. But then it does it again immediately after, and I'm like, what is happening? 
and then it comes closer a third time, but I just feel it like rubbing against my leg. Like, it's just like, it just, it's like, just rubbing against, it's just rubbing against my leg. And I'm like, oh, what the hell? And then at this point, I just jumped out of the water, Fred Flintstone style, started running in place, and then shot out of the water faster than, I don't know, a speeding bullet. Because I was so terrified. I mean, what would you do in that situation, Omer? If, if something tickles your foot in the water? I mean, it tickled my foot three times, and then the third time I did it, I Fred Flintstone out of the water and Fred Flintstone my way out of there. Like, I literally ran up against the shore and I'm just running through the dock trying to get home. And then eventually, like, halfway there, I kind of calm down. And then I go home, I sleep it off. Next morning, or the next day after school, my friends are like, Hey, let's go swim in the river. I'm like, no, no, you are not getting me in that water. And he was like, why, why, what happened? And he was like, dude, dude. I just leaned in close to him and like, dude, I almost died. And he's like, why? What happened? It's like you don't want to know, because I was real. I was real afraid of telling them what happened, because I was afraid they'd be like, "Oh God, you're such a little girl." So did I just you tell them eventually. No, I. Yeah, I did. Oh. I was gonna say no because I'm thinking of this some, of something else, but I told them eventually. Oh. They actually played it off, and they're like, "Holy crap, dude! That could have been like a shark or something." And I actually don't know if sharks swim up swim up there. Do they? Um, probably, I don't know. It's just the water's dirty, so you can't, it's just like being kicked up by dirt all the time. Like, dirt that's on the bottom. So you can't even see. So other than that, that's my story, and that's why I never want to jump into the Hudson River again. I mean, if I was one of those people on that plane that went down in the river, I probably would have like passed out by the pain and just drowned or fainted by like the shock of just being there Bye. so I mean what have you done what would have you done hello I would have done freaking chicken <laughs> There you go, ladies and gentlemen. That's his answer. I would have beat it. So am I needed for anything? Find a chance so I'm not sitting here at DLC what? wasting everyone's time? Are you what? Am I needed anywhere? Uh, maybe. You might be. There's a weird traffic stop thing thing going on here. Where? With Tech Dominion. Yum, yum, yum. Where is it? But, uh, I know, never mind, he's leaving. Why won't anyone abandon their vehicles to be towed? I don't think anyone wants to get their vehicle towed. Imagine you just gonna head over to Citizen Spawn for any vehicles that aren't parked properly. And what I mean by that is, okay. There's a vehicle here, but it's taunting me because I cannot tow that vehicle. It's glitching the ground. Freaking chicken. A das chicken. What is a battlefield hardline bit expire? Um, I don't think it expires when the game comes out. When does the game come out? March 17th. There isn't even a vehicle misparked here. Are you kidding? This game is pr the game is taunting me. I'm lying. Well, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and cut the video here before you. Wait. There is a car needing to be towed. Where?
Wait, I think there goes my timer. Never mind. Oh, where's this car that you said needs to be towed? Uh, Brown Street, I think it is. Wait, well, you're right over there. Let's take a U-turn and take a right. Yeah, I can't tow that car. It's glitched into the, into the world, into the earth. It's glitched into the earth. There's nothing I can do about it. So I'm gonna go ahead and end the video. Oh, 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 oh. I mean, if you can get it free, then I'll come around. But um, either way, oh. guys. Sorry. Either way, I'm gonna go ahead and cut the video here, just so it isn't that long. If you did enjoy or want more of this, because I'm pretty sure something will happen. That may be funny, this is just, I guess, an introductory video to the series, so... I don't know, please stay tuned for this, because I think there can be a lot of funny moments shared with a boring job, because there just always is. And as always, guys, I will see you guys in the next video. Please be sure to hit that like button and subscribe. I'll catch you guys later.